a uh, random Facebook friend who seemed vaguely interested in uh, stuff that I'm working on. Um, I figured I would ask you guys for uh, what you would actually want in a tool like this. Because this is just a random tool that I made um, just to explain some stuff within uh, QT. Um, but it seems like there's a couple people that are interested in having the ability to draw over screenshots and different stuff like that. Um, so I just wanted to run you through this real quick and uh, just so you get your feedback. Again, like the, the visuals of the tool is still definitely a work in progress. Um, and the tool itself isn't even finished. I'll show you one of the features I'm working on. Um, but pretty much, so one of the things that has, these are just some demo, demonstration curves. Um, as far as the, the tool goes, just showing like a, but like a sort of smoothing into it. You can turn the smooth ones on, the normal ones on, and so forth. Um, and you can, like if you're drawing stuff on there, you can undo whatever you have and redo and stuff like that. Um, and here you can see like the smoothing that's happening as well. Um, so that's cool. Um, then you can just grab a screenshot, draw whatever you want. Um, that was my phone getting a text message. If you hear that crazy sound. Um, and you can undo and redo. I'm going to add in some stuff some, uh, to where you can change the colors and all that sort of stuff. I'm not really worried about that at this time. Um, the one thing that I am working on... Oh, yeah, and you can say about the image. And um, Right now, it sort of saves it into uh, wherever you are, but it just sort of saves it this little screen. Um, if you have the resizing on, it'll let you resize that image. Uh, then you got to redraw your little stuff. I'm not worrying about the resizing of that right now. Um, so you pretty much just sort of get the size that you want and then uh, sort of lock it in. Um, but the other thing that I'm working on right now, that's what I'm actually working on right now, is um, getting this to work where it's uh, creating a crop mode. Um, as you can see, there's a couple little issues if I drag it too far. Um, but for the most part it works uh, but that's sort of what I'm working on right now so you can crop it and then you have your image um, that you've cropped taken from the larger image sort of come in um, but like I said I just wanted uh, some uh, since it like you guys would be interested in using a tool like this I figured I would just ask for any um, uh, advice you would have and this is what my original post was about. If I can make a note, uh, hide this one. And I just kept doing this for like uh, longer than I should have, honestly. So uh, yeah, just uh, any any conceptual ideas, I would much appreciate. Um, and yeah, cool.